In this tutorial, I'll show you how to use turbulence. Let's create a plane. Type G, Y, and want to move the plane one unit on the Y axis. Since the origin of the mesh is located in the middle of the mesh, we need to change the origin to the world center before rotating again. R, X, and 90 to rotate 90 degrees on the X axis. I typed S and X to scale on the X axis. In edit mode, let's scale the top edge length. Control R with mouse wheel up to add multiple loop cuts. Let's proportionally move or rotate the top vertices. Shift D to duplicate and R to rotate. I'll select all the meshes and press Ctrl J to join them. There is our grass mesh. Let's create a ground plane and add a set of hair particles. If your grass is lying on the side, please rotate the mesh in edit mode to fix the issue. If we were to animate the mesh by mesh, that will take too long. We could use force field objects for those tasks. The hair particles won't animate, unless we activate the hair dynamics option first. That looks cool, but we need to have the grasses randomly swirling from one direction to another. We need a turbulence for that. Please experiment with both turbulence and particle options to create the best looking result.
This is the end of the tutorial. Thank you for watching.